Actually, when I heard of it, it was a bit difficult for me because anytime I hear of programming, I always think that it's going to be something that is so difficult. We organized the Django Girls purposely to bring the girls in WA and its environs together to give them this computer programming training to beef up their interests in the IT sector so that they would be more exciting and to realize the potentials of what they can do and then explore more in the IT sector, which has become the order of the day. I supported with logistics for Django Girls WA 2019. Um, basically, what we're hoping that participants take away is the ability to continue practicing all the skills that they've got and then all the things that the mentors have been and mentors and coaches have been able to impact to them and also have a ripple effect of them being able to teach others but basically practicing to be very good at them and use them in many different ways as they can. The prime benefits for them is the knowledge in computer coding so that when they go out they'll be able to dive more into computer programming. I got to know of it through a friend. He sent the flyer to me asking me to apply. I was so excited because I've never heard of such a thing anywhere in the Upper West region. And when I saw that it was for all ladies, it gave me the zeal to apply. Today, I really learned a lot. I know I'm going to take it from there. It's not just going to be a one-day thing. I created my own Django admin, and I went on to create my password and my username. We want to say a very big thank you to all our partners, especially PSF, GitHub, Elastic, and then Kofi Photography, for the support that they've given us. Actually, it's not been easy. Without the assistance, we would have been able to organize this program. So we want to say a big thank you to them for all that they've done for us. I would like to encourage the youth out there, especially the ladies, to take some of these programs serious. Because when you relax and you have to enrich yourself, and as a girl child, with all these programs, I believe one day we also get there as individuals. And trust me, even though I've had difficulties, I can't say it was so good, but I can also go out there and tell people about the Jungle Girls. They are really doing a great job. We are really grateful for that. I'll tell people who doesn't know much about programming to take this as a step to start it and to really help them. For the people of the Upper West region, I would encourage them to also support in these activities, not only our key sponsors. We can have sponsors coming from or donors just willing to bring up some of these projects because they really help. It's our pleasure to organize this program because we realize that the IT level in this uh, particular region is very low and then the people in this region need to be uh, educated or they need to have more insights into it. So we are planning to organize it in the other, uh, not only in WA, but in, in other um, communities around WA, and it's for instance, Drapa and Andam and those areas. Go there to introduce the girls to computer programming, and not only into computer programming, but other IT sectors, which has become the order of the day, like artificial intelligence and the robotics and stuff. That is what we intend to do. Um, I want to personally thank our supporters and our partners. They've done so well for coming on board to help us um, bring this to fruition. We are looking forward that in the future they can help us organize many more. I'm a community development student and my passion is to reach rural areas. So to be able to take them to peripheral communities and not just the cities, but to be able to reach out to young girls who have very limited access to these kinds of opportunities. So we're looking forward to working more and more with them and also taking it to other communities as well. Thank you.